Test, 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 test. Are we live? Are we good? I think we are. Greetings, people viewing this live stream. It is I, Silapse, and I'm going to hit continue and start the game immediately. Because it's going to do the bad and it's going to start playing the intro. And the intro kind of screws me over time and time again because it's copywritten and all that. But we are back with Hyperdimension Neptunia Rebirth 1. I changed up my team a little. Maybe I should change it back to something less broken. But uh, for now, hold on, I need to remember buttons. I, I played this game once uh, after a long time of not playing it, only to come back to it again uh, not even a month later, and I'm already confused on what the buttons are. That was, that was, uh, August 1st. Okay, so it's been like a week. It has been a week since I played this game. However, I think the stream was a few days before, and I just came back for a light grind. Uh, but yeah. So that's fun. So last time, we progressed the story... And then we got into one boss fight that ended up uh, killing us. Excuse me. So, uh, that wasn't great. So now we're we're back and we're gonna try doing stuff. I, I still want to have Neptune in the party though. So, buttons, buttons, learning buttons. Okay. Let's see, partner setup. We're gonna switch Neptune back now. Do I like more poison immunity and required SP? Uh, who was it? Was it Uzume that I liked? I like Uzume for her things. Uh, let's put Uzume back on. Uzume. Thank you. All right. So, uh, things, things and stuff. Right, I forgot I even had that as an option. <laughs> uh, do we want to grind or do we want to continue on the story? Let's do a quick little grind here and then see what we can get ourselves up to right after I... All right, that is all set, all done and ready to go. I'm sorry, I have. Please, stop checking your phones for, like, one minute so I can just look at something. It doesn't take that long. Alright, I already forget the controls for the combat. Let's have fun with it. Also, I really want to work on the audio balancing, because I think the game is louder. I'm not sure. Like, it's a louder type game, but I do have my audio turned down for it. To do everyone attack it from behind. School girls always get attacked from behind. All of them leveled up. Way to go. Boom. I'll attack this one. You two attack the giant spider. Oh, there's two giant spiders. I mean, I act like I'm surprised, but I saw it on the little menu icon. Let's all turn our backs to the other one. Sweet, it went for the super beefy child. Gonna hit ya! Oh. Sweet. It was good, Neptune. Also, when I see Neptune, all I think of is the fact that I play this character in every game I possibly can now, and I find it very funny. Da -da 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 -da. All right, cool. We leveled up. Let's go to the event right after we quickly save. Meow. Hold on, my mouse keeps being on screen. I'm skipping the dialogue because I simply do not care. Is there a fast? There we go. Oh, oh no! Giant Wolfie, it's going to kill us, probably. 
Let me use explosive awakening on myself. Boom. IF, you just attack from afar. Demon Flames! And Nep, you are just the worst one in the party right now. Uh, help out baby IF for being beefy, even though she's already got strength up. Alright, I have to do it again. Don't even say the line. Neptune, cross combo. Right now, the whole point of these fights is going to be get back to where I last ended off. That's about what my general plan is. Bum, bum, ba -da -bum, bum. Now we get the cool cutscene. I feel like the audio is too quiet. Bang! Almost 9,000 damage, and Neptune's about to die. That's not good. Nep, you're supposed to live. I guess the IFs are just gonna have to carry you. Yay, it's her turn. She's going to die. So let us run away a little bit. Face that way. And, uh, what is the item button? Oh, shoot, I need to remember which button's which. Uh, okay, I think it's this one. Good. Heals by 1,000. Sure. Item time! My item! Item time! God, I don't do a high voice all that much when I stream. I want to, because I'm very loud at work. But, uh, when I'm actually streaming, I'm pretty quiet. And it's like I've been practicing doing voices at work solely for streaming, but I just don't. <laughs> oh, IF, you're out of SP. I guess I'll just have to start attacking with you. Alright, Nep, let's see what you've got. You can actually reach it. Nice. I think you're the only one with an EXE, so I'll let you do it. Baby IF, use your super powerful move again, that you have, like, unlimited SP for, pretty much. Demon Summon! It missed. Baby IF, how are we supposed to have you carry us if you just sit there and do that? Then we gotta sit through this every time. There's no way to skip it. Demon Summon! There we go, Baby IF. Your damage keeps getting lower and lower, though. Alright, normal IF. Run behind Neptune. And then heal yourself. Healing grass. Go Neptune proper. It's time to defend IF actually. You're not gonna do too much different from the side as opposed to that. Alright, cool. Oh, you actually didn't... You actually didn't shield uh, IF. You instead just both kind of were targets in that. Alright. <laughs> so once again, it's baby IF carries, and she keeps on missing. This is not how it went last time. <laughs> Soon I'm going to be able to quote this whenever I want without it being recent, because I can tell you I'm going to be using this move a lot. Wow, baby IF, your attack is getting weaker. 
You know what? I'm just gonna have you just attack normally. Maybe you're getting close enough where that'll be okay. Baby IF, come on. And then how about right before we kill the bad guy, we... Let's heal up the team. Alright, hear me out. What if we heal the team with life fragment? Good, let's not kill Neptune, but instead let her heal up IF from, uh, from over here, just to be extra sure. Alright, because I want IF and Neptune to actually get XP out of this. I'm sure I can buy life fragments, right? Perfect. <laughs> Good job, baby IF. No need to cry. You literally took no damage. Yay. Now, I'm not reading the dialogue. We've been through this all before. Uh, I gave up the weapon because I used the weapon. Oh, the story's progressing. Oh, we have to go get more stuff again. Like this. Plans. There's another plan right there. Yes, yes, I see. Thank you. Oh, new plan. Let's get this one from Mr. Billy. Alright, oh, this plan. This guy's got a plan to P2. Plan 2. Alright, cool. Let's go to information. Neptune. I think I did these already too, so let's just ignore it. Shaco. Alright, good. Next, uh, shop by... Do we have any... We do not have life fragments, unfortunately. Also, I think I put items on them last time, and I don't have them anymore. Uh... <laughs> Hold on, can this go on? What were the buttons again? Was it... Yeah, it was. Alright, it's not noir. It's only the friend. Hold on. Hello, baby IF. What if we just beef up baby IF? How crazy can we get, like, quick? 10,000? Wait, can I just get her this right now? Can I just make Baby IF our beefy character? The thing is, I could. I could right now. But do I want to? Listen, I got the DLC characters, so I'm gonna use them eventually, sure. But I mean, do I do it this early? I mean, I, I could... What's this one do? This increases health by a bit. Whereas... That one's funky. Then Dual Blade Neptune. What's Dual Blade Neptune? You get to move more. What if we wait to get this one? Sure, let's do that. Oh wait. Okay, these do not help you at all. As much as I want to beef up normal IF, I have a new goal. Uh, ooh, fancy. Fancy. Indoor clothes emphasize the whiteness of everything. Who can equip this? It's Plutia. Alright. Then, bat D clips. That should be nep. Nep, 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 nep. Oh. Strawberry ribbon. I'm not even reading what they are. Oh, things for IF. Wowie. 
The only thing I hate about this is just it changes like their aesthetic for the stats, and I always hate that in games. It's always my least favorite thing. Clute. Neptuna. Yeah. Alright. Clute, Mr. Rabbit. Lavender Chocolate. Yandere Fancy. Fancy. Oh, I've already come full circle. I don't know what those do, because I forget. Let's just, uh... That should be relatively fine for you. And... Yeah, sure. Let's beef up the weak ones. Beefing up the weak ones. Yep, there we go. Okay, uh, there we... There we are. Okay, nobody saw what I just did, right? I don't know. Okay, hold on. Um, menu button. Which one is that? That was this one. Equipment for Neptune. As much as I love your wooden sword, you get this Tachi now. Congratulations. Next. No, not you. Normal IF. You get these claws. Oh, goodness. I haven't heard that noise in a while. Hold on, I've got to look. I've got to close everything to look at it because my thing doesn't like to load. Uh, Moth Girl streams. Thank you for for the for the resub for three months. Very cool. Also, hello, Lotus. Uh, is this that game? Which game, Lotus? That doesn't really tell me much. You have to specify, otherwise I won't know what you're meaning. Anyways, uh, more than likely, if you're asking, is this that game that Neptune is from? Uh, yes. Anyway, um... But what brings you by today, Lotus? How is it going, and what are you doing? Besides watching my stream. This is how I talk. Anyways, I just bought gear for my team a little bit. And this little child version of my favorite character is also our team carry. And I'm about to give her a weapon that makes her super powerful and invincible. So that's cool. DLC's cool. Now what's the pause button again so I can save? So I don't get set back again. There we go. Yay! Now I can stay beefy. Hold on, now I'm curious. It says there's tough enemies here. Uh, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, I just woke up, lol. Imagine being on a team with a younger version of yourself. Yeah, to be fair, if you look at the bottom right there, uh, well, both characters, there's the, the normal versions of them, and then there's the baby versions. They're DLC, and they can just one-shot all of the starting enemies. Whereas the normal versions are- Oh my god, this weapon gives me so much more range. Sorry, unrelated. Uh, she used to have a tiny square in front of her. Now she has a giant rectangle and can sweep enemies even stronger. This dungeon has stronger enemies, by the way. Risky foes. <laughs> You know, things that are supposed to pretty much kill us. And she just, like, what, was that two-shotted or, or uh, one-shotted? I don't know. Or maybe it was three. I think it was three, actually. It's either two or three. Uh, so that's fun. Powers of DLC, sorry to say. I wish it wasn't just DLC. I wish I could do that with normal IF. Alright, I could actually just do that. Unfortunately, I'm not good at angling. Alright, let's take out all of the rabbits. Yay! Hold on, I gotta... Now that you're here, Lotus, wanna see super cool beefy move? I don't even know if you'd care, but here's super beefy move that the child can do.
9,999 damage. On another note, uh, it plays that animation every time and there's no way to skip it. That's the downside, but it's still pretty cool. Out of my way. Boom. Actually, I don't think I'm fighting the tough enemies now that I think about it. That face when Psy can't count. I wasn't paying attention to the hits. I was just like, see, it was it was a quick amount of hits, but I actually didn't pay attention to what the hits were. Ah, here's the beefy enemy. He doesn't look beefy compared to the others. He looks the exact same, but he actually is a mini boss. That's optional. All right, let's see how we can fare against the mini boss, which the last time I ever fought this boss, it wiped my team out immediately. But let's just see if we can do much against it. All right, we did a tick of damage to the health. Everything else went towards its shield. <laughs> it is so bizarre hearing Neptune's actual voice. I know, it's really crazy. Also, my favorite character is IF, but Neptune is still awesome anyways. Uh, also, we're already dying, but at least we weren't one-shotted this time. So that's fun. Way to go, Neptune, getting two hits. I'm still using this move, I gotta. Let's see if we can do more than 9,999. Ah, 10,598. Neptune reminds me of Ruby. Okay, Lotus, I don't know how much you know about the Neptunia games, if anything, besides what I've already talked about. But, literally, Neptune... I can't think of uh, Ruby without thinking about Neptune, because she's so fitting as a similar character. And, uh... Oh, what is it? What is it? There's, a, there's another character in this game, I don't know if you've heard of Noir, but it's like, the dynamic that Neptune has with the character Noir is the same as Ruby and Weiss, and it's just too fitting, and it's like, there's other parallels that I've drawn between it before that I can't remember, but yes, I definitely know where you're coming from. Anyways, Demon Flames. <laughs> also, oh... I hit the wrong button, I wanted to reopen the chat and also say, Lotus, look, I'm actually checking the chat, but now I just put Neptune into a blocking bit. Uh, I have literally never heard of anything else from this game, it's just you. Aw, oh, great, I feel special then. I bought the entire series on a Steam sale, by the way, so I'm going to be playing a lot of Neptune games. Eventually. <laughs> but as of right now, I I am not, because I keep not doing that. That is the most damage Baby IF has ever taken in, well, this, this file at least. Dum -da -dum -dum. Oh yeah, Lotus. Excuse me, random thing, because VR chat and you're a person I've played that with. Uh, I use the Neptune avatar all the time, right? But it's like my favorite character is IF, and if I could have played as IF in VR chat, I would. But so far, I found one model that's PC only, and uh, another model that's PC in Quest, but it's literally just a shitpost avatar. Uh, I'm out of that, right. It's a shitpost avatar, and it's all funky, and it doesn't even have a moving mouth. So I just sit there standing still, and I hate it. I want a moving mouth. 
Uh, but because I can't do that, that's why I use Neptune all the time. Also, love how the Weiss parallel is someone named Noir. Uh, that's very fitting, yeah. Basically, there are four goddess characters in this game. They're, they're supposed to, like, represent actual game things. A lot of things. I'm gonna break down this lore for you real quick, even though I'm getting myself distracted. A lot of characters in this game are all, like, video game company references. Like, for example, IF, uh, she's supposed to be, uh, Idea Factory, which is the people who made the Neptunia games. They are Idea Factory. Neptune is supposed to be based off of, I think it was a Sega console, called something Neptune. Uh, there are four main goddesses in this story. And you've got Neptune, who's supposed to represent, like, Sega and all that, I think. I think. Neptune's always the one I'm confused by. Uh, you have Noir, who represents PlayStation. You have Vert, who represents Xbox. And you have Blanc, who represents, uh, Nintendo. And they live in places that sound like references to the game consoles, and it's just great. It's very fun. This game is just chock full of references. Anyway, I'm gonna continue beating enemies up now. If I could teach more, I would, but I am gonna get so distracted and I also don't know the series too well yet. Uh, just gonna hit people now. Since you're not in VR, the mouth is the only thing you can control, basically, lol. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna close chat for a second. I just want to see. Oh wait, I think Baby IF is gonna die. Okay, to be fair, Baby IF did just die, but in in the future so i'm not completely wrong just partially wrong all right baby if avenge yourself uh lol i just knew vert was xbox because it's green in french yes the three of them are all named after the colors in French. Here's a funny thing, uh... Lotus, to catch you up on the characters... Actually, hold on. I don't care about all these level up messages. Alright. To give you... Why is Nintendo white, though? Oh, you'll understand for a second here, Lotus. So... Uh, you have Neptune, who is... I need to close my mini-map, so I... Or, okay, I closed my chat for a second, because I want to focus on this. So, you've got Neptune, and her homeland is called Planeptune. And it's fun. Uh, you have... Noir, who... Oh, wait, hold on. I only have up to Noir right now for characters you can unlock. Let me just... Eh. So, Noir... Wait, what's the button to, like, look? Is it that? No, that's... I don't remember. Uh... Hold on, let me... No, that doesn't... No, okay. Well, that's Noir. Anyways, her homeland is called La Station. Uh, then there's Vert, who lives in Lean Box, and Blanc lives in Loi. And you, if you don't understand that, it means it's the Wii, like W I I, Loi. And it's just so fun, and I love it. Hold on, I want to fight the mini boss again. They look strong, but you guys just leveled up, so it's okay. 
Uh, I got it, thanks. Yeah, yeah, I'm glad I could explain. I'm sorry, I'm getting so distracted, but I definitely know myself too well, and I know I'm not going to be able to explain and play at the same time. Finally. So it's like, I prefer explaining than actually doing that. What is this? A cutting blade dance that Neptune learned from a book left by a CPU who protected Clan Neptune in the past. So basically herself. So basically, Neptune's a goddess and she doesn't know she's a goddess because she has amnesia. Because at the start, oh, I didn't even explain that. So the very start of the story is Neptune, Blanc, Vert and Noir are all fighting in their god forms. And basically, somebody says, oh, you should all team up on one person uh, to make it easier in the running. So they all team up on Nep, knock her out, she gets sent to the planet, and then is an amnesiac. But basically, what they have going on, the fight between the goddesses, is called the console wars. So it's just, it's essentially exactly what it sounds like. And it's very funny, and I love it. I don't know, I can't explain it too much. I really need to be better at focusing on the game and, like, doing both at once. But anyways, yes, that is, that is the, the opening premise of this. Now, Neptune, redeem yourself for your failure last time. Thank you, Neptune. <laughs> Alright. Uh, do I still have another Demon Flame? I do have another Demon Flame, so I'm gonna run over here and then use it. Oh. Excuse me. Feeling very burpy today. Very burpy. And also very burny. This is me grinding for the next little bit. I just want to make sure I can get back to the part that I died at last time. And then recover. I will not comment on the burp. You just commented on the burp by saying you won't comment on it. You have already failed. Prepare to die. I know your weak spot. Neptune, you stop failing. Oh, I only just remembered Neptune and IF can't get revived after this because they're both pretty much dead. Go, baby IF. Save the day again. By the way, how's the audio balancing? Because I have absolutely no clue with this game, because sometimes it'll get really loud, and then I'll get really loud, and it's, it's always one thing's really loud, the other one's quiet, and I have absolutely no clue how it is. Oh, it's good. Oh, wait. Uh, god damn it. Oh, it's good. All right, thank you. Thank you. Very helpful. I thought it killed IF for a second and I was going to be upset because I want her to get XP. Silapse ping times five. Big fan. Demon Summon! Hmm. And that's a Final Fantasy reference, I'm pretty sure. I'm getting stronger. Yeah. So there, you just saw the three... Wait, no, we have four characters. Not that one. 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 Not this one either. No, not you. Not you. There we go. Okay, you have now met all the characters we're supposed to have at this point. We're only supposed to have four. I think in total, though, whoops. I was scratching with my left hand and I couldn't turn. But anyways, uh, I have mostly all DLC characters. 
Well, not mostly. I have all the DLC characters. Why no Pepeto emote? Uh, what were you scratching? I was scratching my shoulder, thank you. Um, mainly because I want to stick to the whole pixel aesthetic, and I haven't translated Pepeto to something. Plus, he's also a remnant of my old online persona. Not my current one. I might make Pepeto, but as of right now, he doesn't really fit for what, uh, for branding. He's still my son, and I love him, though, and he will definitely remain. Da-da. Also, I'm just gonna collect random gear that I find along the way. I am so glad I bought this for IF at random. Because this is actually gonna be very useful. Bruh, mushrooms aren't your current branding either. The, I wanted them to be, but the thing is, the whole mushroom craze kind of died down for a little. I'm gonna make it come back, though. Don't worry. <laughs> it's just a matter of doing cool Minecraft things. That's all. Uh, I'm gonna fight one more of these guys, at least. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Gonna heal my- or er, strengthen myself. Boink. I had an entire mushroom craze for like a year though, Lotus. It's definitely my branding. It's just not up to date. I need to work on it a bit more. But I also cut down on Minecraft, and Minecraft was my biggest source of the branding. Especially since the entire point of it came from Minecraft and trying to code in a mushroom. Neptune, you keep missing every time you use that move. Please be better at the game. Ah, uh, Lotus, by the way, the last stream I did, I passed out again. I have passed out a total of three streams now, and I'm starting to get depressed by it. It was, it was the stream that I did after the stream that I last did with you guys. So like my morning stream and not my late night stream. I would like an example of what your mushroom craze consisted of. Uh, developing a mushroom persona known as Shroom Laps. Uh, dedicating all builds to mushrooms. Going across SMPs... Oh god, Neptune's about to die. Going across SMPs, doing all of the mushroom-related things, such as finding Mushroom and bringing them to my home. Uh, making all of the mushroom stews that you can with all of the flowers. Uh, what did I do outside of it? There were a couple things I did outside of it. Obsessing over any mushroom thing I found in other games. I think I started a mushroom cult on VR chat once. It wasn't just one of those one-time cults, it was something that actually lasted a little bit longer. But, uh, I think that died out eventually, or at least I never touched on it again. Um, hold on, I need to think about what I'm doing in the game. Right, I want to do this. Heal myself. Fight of time! Fight of time! Fuck. Uh, I think I used up all of my revives, didn't I? IF isn't gonna get any of this XP. I hate that. <laughs> Alright, now avenge yourself, baby IF. You have to kill it. Kill the bunny. There was that time I tried coding in a mushroom into Minecraft. That took me uh, several months of trying to learn. And then experimenting and learning and experimenting more and more. That is that is also a thing and the whole origin of it. <laughs> oh, 
All right, good. At least Neptune's not going to get it either. That way I can feel better about something at least. Baby IF saves the day. Everyone levels up except for the two dead people who are now dead in my party. I can't even run around as Big IF anymore. Now I am Baby IF. Hold on. When it comes to the animations, does she have her classic stuff or new stuff? New stuff. Alright, cool. Uh, I think I'm going to leave this dungeon. I don't remember where the exit is, however. This is not the exit, but I will take these items. Thank you. Well, I need to see better. Whee! I'm an airplane! I wanna I wanna be loud with my things, but I actually can't. Mainly because the headphones really throw me off whenever I do s or make noises. Item. Items, items, give me. Thank you. Bye bye. Whoops, that's not the item or the thing I wanted to do. I wanted to go bam. Exit. I'd like to leave, please. I don't actually remember if they revive after you leave. Uh, yes they do. That's good. Let's save. Dum, dum, dum. I do not want baby IF to be the leader. I want normal IF to be the leader. Thank you. Time to go see what's happening over here. Except for the fact that I've seen it all and I'm skipping it. If you weren't here for the last stream, that's too bad. Ugh. By the way, this is essentially your ruby and weiss right there, but you don't get to see the context of it. If you want to see the context of it, you'll just have to see the last VOD. Either that or... Uh, it might already be deleted and I have to upload it to the VODs channel, because usually I private everything. Oh, right. Also, here's La Station. Uh, I believe it's up. Here's here's Louis. You can tell it's the Nintendo place because it's got all the little mushroom cap looking things. And I believe this is Leanbox. Could be wrong. I don't know. It should be. It's the only other giant place here that seems to matter. So yeah, that's that. Anyways, we're gonna go to a dungeon now. <laughs> and so, Neff and family have arrived to a closed factory for Avenir's work. I've seen it all already, but it's voice acted, and I want to hear the voice acting a little bit. Neptunia UI looks like Dongon Rampa. I can see that. You're happy as usual. Ah, uh, just to let you know, also, Lotus, uh, the reason why Noir wears glasses here is because uh, people in La Station will recognize her as Noir, aka the, the demi form of the goddess. So she needs a disguise to walk around in public and not be recognized. So she wears these red glasses that she found. That way she is forever disguised and nobody will know it is her. Hey, when you don't have your memory, you can do whatever you want. I sometimes admire your free nature. In any case, what's this about being called to this kind of place? It's been a while, folks. I'd like to have work done again for you. Ganache. We already know what happens with Ganache. You must work a lot. Don't get burned out, you hear? Do I look that busy? I've been taking my breaks quite liberally. I wish I could take breaks when I want to. Well, most of our work is handled by machines. So things are easy. Now, getting back to business, let's get right into the subject. As you can see, it has been years since this facility was in operation. 
So, what are we doing here? There is a certain item we have not recovered since the closure. We want you to find it and bring it back to us. Is that it? Wow, it sounds even easier than before. It does, doesn't it? Well, on the contrary, there's monsters there now. I see. So you need us to go in and take care of that, too. So what's this thing we need to recover? It sounds pretty important. It is a certain ore. We call it the Lastalite. Just one gram holds energy to power a game console for 10,000 years. The excavation of it is difficult, so we'd like to recover what we have. I've never heard of such an ore before. Lastalite? I'd never heard of it too. If it's that great, I would at least know about it. Well, of course. We held monopoly of this ore. We did not disclose it for the sake of holding full control of it. That super. Do you mind giving us a small wee bit? Hey, no, no fooling around now. But Iffy, it can run game consoles for ten thousand years. Ten thousand years. It's like the magic power we gamers were looking for all our lives. We need ten thousand years of content making. How how long do you think? we could manage if we had the ability to continue living on past the normal human life expectancy how long do you think we'd manage i would love i would love to just keep streaming for 10,000 years be the oldest ever twitch streamer that'd be great and then i'd play the neptune games again and i'd be like oh guys I remember when I saw this first time I ever played this game about, what was it, 9,000 years ago? Ah, good times, good times. Man, this stuff is crazy, man. Anyways, we gamers. Yes, we gamers. Neptune is a big gamer. Well, if you would like some, I can certainly spare a small bit. Really? No. Yes. We were able to work efficiently because of your work the last time. Bruh, the fall of Rome was like 2,000 years ago. Can you even, even fathom uh, how much technology would change? Uh, no, I can't. But then again, there's a possibility we might not progress overly super far in 10,000 years. I think we are going to be exactly like this from then on. I'm going to play all of the Neptunia games that get made in the next 10,000 years. Besides the small ones like the Neptune shooter from before. From like a month or two ago. As long as you keep this a secret, I don't see any harm sharing with it. Yay! I thought Avenir was kind of blah, but Ganache saved the day. Oh yeah, for context, Avenir is like this big company group, and they're, they're funky. They want to, like, take over small businesses and all that with factories, and it's funky. You're just going to be that one old guy who refuses to buy DVDs and doesn't sell his VCR. <laughs> oh, I wanted to be that guy, but my family was like, no, we like DVDs. And I was like, but a VCR is so cool. Everyone's getting rid of their VCRs, and I like my tapes. How am I going to watch uh, the Digimon movie when... when I don't have VCR anymore. This is before I was allowed to use a computer, which we didn't even use it for long. Like, they got rid of it because my father got so many viruses on it. Because he didn't know what he was doing, and he's a brain injury man. Uh, but yeah, I... I loved having a VCR and so many tapes, only for them all to be gone now. 
Anyway. I'm happy to know that. I'm glad, Ganache. I'm glad somebody enjoyed my story. Now we don't want to waste time here. Please take care of the orb. Okay, leave it to Captain Nep and her friendly crew. I'm so accurate. You are Lotus. For some reason, you are the person who just understands me way too soon. Like, you catch on to stuff so much faster than most people wouldn't. And it's it's surprising, and I don't understand why. Sure, Captain. Lead us to the depths of the ocean. Yay, ocean. Wait, I'm a hydrophobic. Oh, this isn't the ocean. What? Why did the entrance close behind us? Ganache, what's going on? Oh, my bad. I must have pressed something. Ah, uh, that's fine. Just try pressing something again, and then you can open the door for us, and we can leave. Well, that's not quite true. I shut it for my convenience. Oh, uh, could you please reopen it then? That way we're able to leave. I'd like to ask you all to satisfy the hunger of the monsters there. Okay. Do you have any O. Henry? I didn't make any jokes the last time I went through this cutscene, but now I'm feeling jokey. Hey, what? Why? I'm not gonna go get your precious ore if you do this. Ah, uh, Neptune, you can't say that. Come on, this ore is that. Like, do you know what power this ore holds? You gotta listen. You oh. actually believed what I said. Oh no. Of course there's no such thing as an ore that can house that much energy. He lied to gamers. What? You tricked us? But why? Okay, let me say, she's like Weiss, but more dumb, also. I already know you are assisting Shion of Passe. I assume you were trying to get information on our exhibit plans, no? Iffy, they knew all along. <clears throat> I can't believe they knew about this. We would win regardless, but I'm the careful type, you know. Now then, I don't have much time, so I need to go. Farewell. I don't remember the context, but it's basically like... Kind of like an inventor's... Back-to-back -back type thing. And the best inventor wins. It's like it's company versus versus person who the entire community rallied behind to help make a cool thing. Wait, Ganache! Well, looks like the way out is sealed tight. Nippy, what's gonna happen to us? Um, well... Also, I didn't explain this character. I explained three of the characters. This is Kampa. She's the one who finds Neptune unconscious and brings her home and introduces her to Pudding. And Neptune is obsessed with Pudding. That's all you need to know for now. She's also a nurse. I'm sorry. This is all my fault. Because she's a goddess and she thinks that they recognize that she was the goddess, so they wanted to overthrow her, because Avenir hates the goddess. Such an inconvenient sweater. Yeah. If I didn't suggest taking Avenir's work, this wouldn't have... Oh, come on, gals. What's the matter? This isn't like us. It's not like we can't get out. Let's just try to look for another way. Neptune. Nep is right. This is a large area, so there has to be a way out. I'm not one to become monster food. Let's go! Ooh, more things to say, just because you're here, Lotus, and you're still active in chat, so I know you're here. Uh, because you don't know much about this game, besides, uh... What, I, what I've told you, apparently, uh, a big thing from this community is that Basically, the entire game, or all the characters that you see, 10 to 1, have been massively shipped with each other. People ship all of the characters a lot of the time. And there are some that are way more popular than others, as, as it would go, but 
just to keep you up on that. Like, people really like Neptune and Noir. People really like Kampa and IF. People really like other characters who aren't here yet. Literally, the windows in the background. I think this is supposed to be, like, the door that was shut. But then we've also got this ventilation shaft and this hole. Oh, there's windows over here, too. Also, Neptune can turn into her goddess form and can fly. And she can carry people. So, I mean, technically, she could just do that. But I guess we're gonna do this instead. An enemy! And to be fair, she could be truthful to those words. <clears throat> There's a tentacle doggy. Oh my god, I don't know what game it is. If it's this game or one of the other games. But I can definitely think of something that will either interest you or put you off completely in this game, Lotus. Hold on. There we go. And does it have relevance to that thing we just killed? Sort of. Anyways, let's progress with the story. I think I've decided up to the point that I played, uh, I'll, I'll listen to voice acted cutscenes, but ones that aren't, I'm gonna skip. Yeah, I like this one. No voices. I skip it. Anime girls are so stupid, yes. But then where's the conflict in the dungeon exploring? Also, there's Neptune's other form. How foolish, facing me. Alright, time to attack the big bad boss thing. Come forth, Black Wolf. Destroy all who stand in my way. Ah, to catch you up on more stuff. So basically, characters have CPU forms, and that is Neptune's CPU form. And basically, it's like I said, it's her goddess form. So that's why she's this funky person. And she also goes from silly girl to more serious woman. So that is another thing, and you're gonna see a lot of characters who are like this later on. Such as Noir, but the gang doesn't know this yet. It's purple, I love it. Yes, her name is Purple Heart when she's like this. Uh, normal IF, you can do Demon Flames, because it's just better. I know you can hit that guy. There we go. AoE attack. Do, do, do. Alright. You know, I've seen her do cross combo in this but i've never seen her do critical edge in hdd because this is the first time i've ever had the move all right so that was that bum, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -ba -bum. coming through baby if about to sleep Do -do 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 -do. I do not care about these words. For me personally, I like normal Neptune over Purple Heart. But even so, I do like Purple Heart. Items. Enemy. Alright. Do 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 if you're in front of the enemy, like whichever way they're facing, if you're in front of them, you do less damage. If you're to the side of them, you do half as much damage. Well, not half as much, but like 
0.5 more damage, and if you're from behind and facing them, you do two times damage, I think is how it works. Maybe not those numbers exactly, but it's basically attacking from the front is the lowest, side is middle, and back is highest. Ah! Hello, IF. Anyway, it's also a wall for the edge. Doop, doop, doop. This is really just going to be me talking to Lotus about the game now. Just because she's in the chat and doesn't really know much about this game. So then I'm just like, oh, and this, and this, and this. That is all it is. Illegal memory. Illegal circuit. Cool. I have illegal things. I am now a criminal. Go to the event space and avoid the enemies. We need to progress to where we last were. I, I was about to read, but I also don't want to read what I've already read. I think we're closing in on the boss that killed us, though. It might actually be this. I think I killed this guy. Excuse me, I could be wrong. As a just-in-case, I think I'm going to try and keep myself powerful. Oh. Uh... I don't think it's supposed to look like that. But, uh, okay. Uh... You're a criminal, but make it anime. Yes, that is correct. Oh, right, I have another character on my team in the bottom left there, who's a DLC character, but they also have a CPU form. However, I... Actually, who's who's stronger? Can I check that? That is not what I wanted. Uh... I think O is... Yeah, I can't check right now. I want to see who's stronger, but it's like I'm probably just going to use normal Neptune. Duke, 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 duke. So, who wants to get first? so that was cross combo as Purple Heart. I just wanted to show that, but now I'm gonna switch back after. Ba, 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 ja, ba, ba. Critical Edge. I really hate having my mouse on screen. I know there's a way to turn it off on the game capture, but some games that I pull up uh, use that, and I also don't want to keep forgetting about it, turning it on and off. Demon Summon! Almost 14,000 damage. Neptune is about to die again, and we have no way of healing her. IF is also out of special attacks. So I guess we're just gonna... What if I switch to... Er, Kampa? Here, I don't want to have IF die this time. Alright, now we have Kampa on the team, and her weapon is a giant fucking syringe that she stabs people with. Anyways, that is Kampa. <laughs> baby IF, you have to protect baby Neptune, who is not a baby in character, but is a baby because she's super weak, because she's not DLC. Uh, I can't see her mouse. Maybe I have it turned off then. That might be better. Actually, I can just look at my stream and be like, oh, where is it? Where's the guy? No, he's not there. That's good. That's good. I like it. Alright. Uh, so Neptune is going to die again. So let's not have her die. Now's the time. You're hurt. Leave it to me. Yay. Little combo. So she's a big healer. She only has healing moves. So we're gonna just start poking this thing. Shot. 
Well, Kampa was one-shotted. Also, I think it gave a poison effect to the robot or something. I didn't pay attention to what that was. And I kind of forgot that you can do status effects to enemies. We are going to see this attack way too much. I'm only ever going to use it when I'm using Baby IF. Oh, hey, it's about to die. That's pretty good. Neptune, get in there. Finish it. Except for the fact that it still has guard. Yeah. We were a hit away from beating it, Neptune. We were a hit away. And now you die. So you don't get any XP. Why do I have to keep carrying you? Why? Alright, well, Neptune is now dead and she's not going to get XP from this fight again. Let's finish it. It is. Really, it is. I'm pretty sure I beat this boss before. I feel like there's one more boss that I fought, but I don't remember, so I'll just read these dialogues. However, I'm not doing voices because I think I'm going to scuff it. This is the end. Looks like it was merely a grunt uh, that should have come in. No, no, I have done this one. I'm skipping it. GDI Neptune, you fucking loser. Yes. I don't know what GDI means. Iron Ore, perfect. How many, how long can that power a game console? Wait, is this where we're going? Yeah, because we want to leave the dungeon. Yay, we're outside. Dialogue. God damn it. Alright, thank you. It means god damn it. Anyway. <laughs> I have to apologize to everyone later for getting them involved. Oh, Iffy, you're such a worry ward. You're thinking too much. We came out in one piece, so all is good. Let's just go back to Xion. What? That's right, Xion! She's in danger! What do you mean, Iffy? Remember what Ganache said when he trapped us? I already know you were assisting Xion of Passe. I assume you were trying to get information on our exhibit files, no? Iffy, they knew all along. I can't believe they knew about this. We would win regardless, but I'm the careful type, you know. Well, I don't have much time, so I need to go now. Farewell. He knew we were helping Xion. That means she's the next target. What? Well then, we need to get back to her, pronto. What's he thinking, targeting civilians just for the expo? Now I'm really mad. I won't let Ganache or Azanir get away with this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now Noir is really mad. Noir, you're scaring me. You girls, stop with the jibber-jabber. Let's hurry and save Chion. Yes, yes. And we skip dialogue, because I refuse to read what I've read already. You miss all of this explanation and elaboration. Oh, hey, I should probably explain 
Uh, they didn't... Oh, this is the guy who killed me last time. So basically, like I said, Noir is a goddess. And she has a uh, CPU form as well. And basically, she attacked Neptune and Gang earlier in a boss fight. And then we beat her. And then she fled away and turned to normal form. And then she was just like, oh, hey, I'm actually just some random person who got injured in this area. And then they were all like, oh, okay. Except for IF, because she's smart and not an idiot. So she didn't believe her, but she was just like, I guess we're going along with this. Anyways, time for baby IF to hopefully carry this time. Which they did already. Because this guy's very beefy. Excuse me, but last time I didn't have the super cool powers that I have. Nep's gonna die, so I'm just gonna switch to a, the other character. Uh... I'll leave the rest to you. Spiral dream. Meet Orange Heart, a character who doesn't appear for another couple games. Uh, Dream Roar, Heal, Dream Smash Fist. Let's go with Dream Smash Fist. <laughs> uh, what just happened? Uh, why did IF just explode? Because this guy did a super power attack, and IF is not DLC. So she dies very quick. Here's the thing, I really want to always have IF on the team, but she is going to be so weak compared to the DLC characters I have. I also really want Neptune on the team, because it's just nice to have the character that I keep on using and everything on the team. So with only one DLC character, it's going to be very unbalanced. Because more than likely, I'm going to be too strong with the DLC character that I'm going to progress forward too much. Faster than Neptune and IF can level up. So, that's why they keep dying so quick. Oh, hey, I see Mr. Mouse. What? I thought you couldn't see Mr. Mouse. Man. You see him doing little spins in the center of the screen? Ah, oh, baby IF is actually going to die at this rate. Quickly, save us, Orange Heart. He spin round round. Okay, let me see if I can turn that off real quick. Because I believe that's in my game capture settings. Uh, capture cursor. No thank you. Bye bye. Alright, baby IF. You are about to die. So let's heal you up a little bit. Uh. Yay. Now you should be able to survive at least one hit. I'm gonna say this right now. If Baby IF dies, the game is over. Because I am telling you that Orange Heart will not be able to take this thing on. <laughs> so we kind of need uh, Baby IF to live. Healing pod. Yay, Uzume, you're gonna save the day. Death to all who oppose me. 
I was gonna yell Chaos Blast, but I feel like I was too slow on the delivery. Baby IF, just keep at it. The good news is, if we actually have Orange Heart up and alive, we can at least have somebody who can heal us on the sidelines if we need it. I don't know how much she can heal for, but she can heal, and that's all that really matters. Uh, unfortunately, I kind of need to make sure that Baby IF does not die. So... Okay. Well, now Uzume is dead. So that's fun. Uh, so now it's all up to Baby IF. She has to solo the boss again. And last time she sol soloed the boss, I got sent very, very far back. So let's hope we do better this time. <laughs> However, she is not doing great, but I might be able to just hold up as I am. <laughs> We're gonna keep seeing this attack a lot, though. I'm really glad that her super powerful attack is so cheap in SP cost. Baby IF might be able to take another hit, however, I'm going to be safe. Uh, I feel like you're gonna come to a point where you have... Or you have to replace normal IF and Neptune with DLC. That's very likely. But I've stated since the day IF, uh, we ran into IF in the game, uh, and she joined the party, I said I am never taking IF off the team. Ever. She's always going to be in the main party. I might switch between her and whoever I have as her partner, but when it comes to actually having a character on the team, IF is always going to be there, and I'm just going to have to live with it. <laughs> Uh, let me remove that real quick so I can see what I'm clicking here. Alright, baby IF, time to heal yourself again. It missed! Let's go! It missed again. It's an idiot. It's a fool. We'll win this time. Probably. I hope. If we lose this, that's gonna be kind of sad. But we should be able to take this guy down. Just because IF is so cool and strong. It has missed the last three shots. Let's just stand here again. How does it feel to be soloed by a child? This wasn't my true strength. Hyper Dimension Neptunia. Silapse is in love with IF mode. True! It Here's the thing that's very sad. My favorite character in this series is the company who made the game self-insert. It's just unfortunate. Yay, everyone levels up except for the actual character themselves. But also, I think IF is lesbian, or she shows lesbian-like moments in the games and in the little anime shorts. But, uh, I don't know where the ball is on that exactly. Anyways, we have new dialogue, so I actually get to read. With the two of us, this was easy. They did literally nothing. It was a child who did all of the work. Where's Ganache? Seems like he got away. Well, no matter. He'll get what he deserves the next time. By the way, Lois, I don't know if you've been here when I play a game with dialogue to read, but usually I can't read it clearly. I'm very bad at reading out loud. I'm better at reading in my head. Speaking of, Noir, that form of yours... 
You look just like Nep Nep transformed. You mean this form? Well, of course. I'm the CPU of the station. What? I had my reasons, but first off, I'm sorry for hiding my identity. That said, thanks to your help, I couldn't have won without your help. I didn't expect Noir to be Lestation's CPU. I'm just as surprised as when Nepnep transformed. Not me, I knew all along, just cause IF is cool. I am also better at reading in my head. That is good. No way. Seriously? Was that your best hiding your identity? Great. All this hiding my identity was for nothing then. That's right. You know who I am, right? Can you please tell me? Answer the amnesiac's questions. Please. She needs to know. Come now, I'm serious. I'm serious here. Well, it's not much of a secret, so you might as well say it. Iffy? You know who Nepnep -Nep is? Yes, once I saw Noir transform. Huh? That means... You can't mean... Wait, really? Nepnep -Nep is... What? Huh? Now Compa knows? Really? Compa? Oh, come on, just say it already. Alright. Neptune, you're the CPU of Planeptune. You're Purple Heart. Seriously? Nep Nep's in shock over her own self. Iffy, what should I do? Me, a CPU, Planeptune, really? Why don't you change back first? Uh, okay, I can't show my variety of expressions in this form anyway. <laughs> it's not like we're gonna use your entire repertoire of expressions. Uh, but really, is me being me Okay with everyone? Yes. Who would have expected you to be the CPU of Planeptune? Neptune is the CPU of Planeptune. It's as if it's in the name. What is going on, though? All I did was see Nepnep -Nep fall from the, the sky. Did you finally notice? Everything around Nep isn't humanly possible. For the record, falling from the sky is not normal even for a goddess. Um, just to make sure, are you sure I'm okay as CPU of Planetune? Not I'm okay, you are the CPU of Planetune. Don't worry, we won't fight now. I need to first rebuild the station. Alright, cool. Now we get to go back to the station and do the things. Now that things are calm, don't you or uh, don't you need to show your identity to Chion? Now is still not the time. Honestly, showing myself now would just make matters worse. So I'll get back in shape before showing my identity. Do you have a plan? Plan? No. I'm just gonna do my best to help everyone living here. Now that the CPU Lady Blackheart... Uh, wait. Now that's the CPU Lady Blackheart I know and respect. Cut the honorifics. Just call me Noir. I like that better anyways. It will take some time getting used to, but okay, Noir. You guys have only been calling her Noir this entire time. Compared to Noir, or no, yeah, compared to Noir, looking towards Nep. <sighs> Fuck, I can't do snoring noises, they make me uncomfortable. 
Uh, why were the goddesses even fighting? Because it's the console wars. Just like in video games, or video game console selling. It's the console wars. It was Neptune versus Nintendo versus Xbox versus PlayStation. And they all ganged up on Neptune, wiping her off the face of the earth. Uh, she's sound asleep. She must be ha- er, she must have been really tired. The worst part about reading dialogue in a game for me is that I try to guess what the words are before I read them, and I just assume I know where it's going. But then it's not how I thought, so then I'm just like, uh... Coming through. Cheon. Oh wait, no. Fuck. <laughs> Good example. Cheon, is the factory all okay now? Thanks to you, we've got a lot cleaned up. The rest is for tomorrow. So, how is the factory, really? Most of it is in unworkable condition. Not much to be done about it. Is that so? <sighs> huh? Chion? Since when? I just arrived. Sorry to wake you up, Sleeping Beauty. What are you going to do now? With the expo around the corner, I need the factory to be running first. Uh, so that means you won't have to work a, or work a while then. Sorry about that. Well, let's head back to Planetoon then. Yes, with no leads on the cre or on the key fragment, I guess there isn't much choice. Here's your weapon back, Chion. I never used it in battle. I never equipped it. And I barely fought anyways. Thanks. When the expo is near, come back. I'll ask you for more tests then. What if I just don't use it? That would be great. I'm looking forward to seeing your new factory then. Heh. <laughs> Count on it. I'll get everything back to full operation. Armus test model 1.0.1 .1 given up even though we never used it. For testing. Oh my god, a new event. Huh? Noah isn't or er, Noah isn't coming with us? Don't call me Noah. It's Noir. Oh come on, you can call me Neppy if you'd like. No, I won't. No, wait. Why would I? You were sleeping back there, so you may not know, but I need to take care of things here first. Ah, and just when I thought we were going to be best buddies. Now, now, Nep Nep, let's not bother Noir. We have to find the key fragment in the station so we can come back. True. We'll be back again. I'll be sure to greet you with open arms then. Oh, and Neptune? Don't go around saying you're a CPU, you hear? I'm not sure about the other lands, but each has their own problems. That's right. If they find out no or if they find out, no telling what would come our way. Oh, I'm not that dumb, you know. That's debatable. I just have to reveal my identity, right? Before the last scene, right? Just like in theater. Oh, then I wanna come out at the end or at the encore call. Ooh, good, good, Compa. And we'll have Iffy pull the curtains backstage. IF? Are you sure you're going to be fine? I'm fine. Or maybe not. I'm already getting a headache. I also like how they're kind of on the same wavelength of we've got to tolerate the dumb people. Very fun. I just got an achievement. I did it. I reached chapter two. It only took me like half a year to get to chapter two. 
Uh, okay, my phone is lagging like crazy, so I can't watch anymore. Just constant buffering. That's too bad. But oh well. Unless, of course, that's on my end, because my streams haven't been handling too well as of late. Oh no, it's been fine on my end. Well, that's too bad, Lotus. But hey, it was fun seeing you here, I suppose, and then talking about Neptunia things. Unless you're just not watching, but you can still hear. I don't know your plans. Anyway. The bed is comfy. Game's all over. And pudding stuffed in the fridge. Great way to greet the new chapter. Slacking off and off. You're so serious, Iffy. We did a lot at last station, so give me a break. Give you a break? Well, maybe if the break wasn't over a week already. Come on, now's my only chance to cozy with the puddings, you dig? Who's gonna kick back now? It's me, yo. <sighs> really? She's the CPU for Planetune? Yes. Nap, nap. <clears throat> I made some tasty, tasty milk pudding. Yay, pudding, milk pudding, milky milk pudding. Pompa. You really have to stop treating Nep like a queen. I know, but seeing Nep Nep melt away with my pudding is just so cute. Kampa, this pudding is the bomb. Can I get some more of these morsels? I'm happy you like them, Nep Nep. More coming right up. <sighs> these two. Well, I guess it's better than being in peril now. I suppose enjoying the moment isn't bad. Well, I better get started. Iffy, what you doing? Single player checkers? Single player rummy? Oh, shut it. No, I was just checking the goddess's blog. Huh? The goddesses are bloggers? Even noir? No, only the CPU for lean box Lady Greenheart has a blog. Shucks. If noir had one, I was gonna tease her over her entries. Wow, that's low. Anyways, what kind of stuff does she have up there? Like some pic shot of her licking pizzas? Or a self-made fantasy poem? You really think a goddess would post random junk like that? Yes. Let me see there. Monsters <clears throat> have been appearing of recent. Please be wary. See? Lady Greenheart isn't a goober like you. Now give me back my cell. Oh, wait, Iffy, there's a hidden link here. What idiotic nonsense are you saying now? Wait, you're right. Let's see what's there. Click. Wait a minute, Nep. Welcome to my hidden page. I will be posting my private diary here. Lady Greenheart's diary? You shouldn't read others' diaries. Oh yeah, sure. I bet Iffy is going to check it out yourself, right? Me? Look at Lady Greenheart's private life? No, no. Wait a look calm there, Iffy. I, I would never do such a thing. Come on, let's just read it out loud. Let's see now. I bought six new games. My backlog is getting too big. Huh? I can't wait to get my Tsundere Otaku eyeglasses set. Hey, that's the limited edition released by the Otomate Branded Company. IF silence wasn't even silence. <laughs> okay, I just started talking and a mosquito just got killed in my lips. Anyways, <laughs> the silence had a little buffer noise from s the start and at the end, but not the in-between. see. Can't play four goddesses online with the server error. Aww. Hey, that's another game in the series. Four goddesses online. Woo! We're gonna play that eventually. I don't know when, though, probably after the Rebirth games, and then, depending on if I want to play, I'm gonna say the V games, because 
there's like V and VII, but I think it's supposed to be five. But then it's like five and then five two. So I guess Lady Roman is a gamer. What's four goddesses online anyway? You'll soon learn that. My image of Lady Greenheart, it's crumbling. Oh, did the difference between image and reality shock you, Iffy? I know. Basilica must have made this to, to give her a more natural image. My Lady Greenheart would never be this much of a gamer. Well, coming from a gamer like me, she smells like a full blast gamer. No. She's just trying to appeal to the public. Oh, so you want to bet and see by meeting her face to face? Sure then. If you're wrong, I'm taking one week's worth of your pudding. It's on, Iffy. You better be ready to bring my prize on a silver platter. This isn't the reason I expected we would go to Lean Box War. Yay, lean box has been unlocked, but first I'm gonna go to the bathroom. So we're gonna sit here and listen to the cool music or wait for somebody to appear in my Discord call to entertain while I go to the bathroom. So goodbye for the moment. I will return.
And I am back already. Hello. Uh, excuse me. I just realized maybe my character in this placement isn't the best. Might be better on the top left, but I don't have a thing set up for that. And I'm too lazy to make one. So I'm going to continue on my journey. Let's go! After we get all these things, hold on. I do not care about what you guys have to say. I do not care to show it all on the screen. I've already seen what it is. And although new people might be able to see it for the first time, I do not care. Because I know how insignificant it is to see every single one. Some of them can be cool, but for the most part... Hello, ramen connoisseur. Uh, shop. What money do we have? How much money? We have enough to get another another of the broken weapon for IF if we want to make the same thing for baby IF. Uh, the Tachi. What do you have on you right now? Did I not give you your Tachi? Neptune, what are you what are you using right now? Why are you back to the wooden sword? I gave you the Tachi. Whoop. No, I don't want that. I just want to make IF the leader again. Ba -da 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 -da. Also, let's save real quick. Boop -ba -doop -ba -doop. I read EXE gauge as EXA or EXE sauce, and I was a bit confused. Anyway. Um, 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 um. Right, now we can go back to the shop and see what we can purchase. No items. I can't sell the basic wooden sword, unfortunately. Viscous elegant crown, strawberry ribbon, rabbit ears. Ears. I'm just making noises. That's all I'm doing. Let us buy some stuff. So yeah, we can't make that, unfortunately. Hey, new weapons for the DLC characters that I'm not going to equip it to. Okay, now hear me out. What if I sold the thing I'm using currently? How do I actually check the... There's a details button. Which one is that connected to, though? Is that nine? That might be, and it's just that's what it looks like. Yeah, because O does nothing. This does not tell me how to see its range. Oh, well, yes, it does. It's a slash. All right, so Freak Diamond is a normal attack, whereas this one is a wide attack. Hold on, I should probably go on that IF. All right. So this one is cool. <laughs> R slash. I don't remember what R slash is. Let me look it up. R slash attack, I should say. This does not assist. Um, 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 um. Hold on. Uh... Do, do, do. I'm just curious to see what this is while I'm... While it's in my mind. Aww. Okay, that doesn't really help me. How about I just look up... No, Slash just isn't even in there, so it's not going to be here. Oh well. 
I guess I just won't know what it is until I pick it. Which I'm probably not going to pick it for a little bit. <gasps> I really need to stop yawning. <laughs> I don't want to pass out on stream again. Yay, chapter 2 gear. This does not help baby IF at all. Do, 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 do. You have the leather one. But with the power of coolness, I could give you the beefier ones. Nah. Oh, right. I think I gave you one of these before. Uh, the, the game save issue happened. I think it was the life ring. So I'll give that to you, Aya. Ah! I need to stop yawning. I was going to say anything new, but I actually have no clue. Also, monochrome jersey. I was tempted to buy it, but I don't think I will. Even though I want to see what the outfits look like, because you can't, you can't like pre-see them. They're just kind of what they are. They're the name, and you just have to hope that it looks cool to you. Is there anything I can add to? What do I have on Baby IF? I don't think I have anything on Baby IF, do I? I mean, that life ring would definitely help. Ah, oh, but the flame ring could also be cool. The life ring is just better, so I'm going to get you one. So both IFs can have it. Do -do -do. Bug strap. IF only. A cell phone strap with a bug. Cute, we guess. Life ring. Now you're beefy. Next, this IF. Whoop. You get... A life ring, again. Leather versus cell phone strap. Increases agility by a little bit. That's not overly big for us. Claw. Well, what's this? Ah, cool. Ba, ba, ba. Ah. Uh, should I get something else for someone? I don't know. Probably not. I think I'm going to be lazy, and I'm going to skip past. I am going to save, however. Boop. So now we're beefy. Oh, there's a different shop. Did not know this. However, is it all just the same items? Very well could be. Oh, no, they have... No, that's life ring. Not, not the other life thing that I wanted to find. Monochrome jersey. I want to see it, but it's also I like classic Neptune So I kind of don't want to do that I'd like to see the event going on right after I talk to all of these characters who could give me things Toady That was my chance to do a toad impression and I refused Oh well Home security I'm skipping you I hope so too. By the way, what is Ify looking at on yourself? Lady Greenheart's blog. There was just an update, so she must be here. <laughs> no, that can't be. I'm pretty sure someone else is doing the blog entries. Don't ruin my image any more than you need to. I'm sorry, but I didn't expect you to be so into Lady Greenheart's blog. Well, sorry for being a follower. Oh, nap nap. Stop teasing Ify already. Let's go inside. I wouldn't mind playing with Ify a bit more, but 
I guess I'll do it later. Hello. We're here to see the CPU. My, oh my. What a lively group of young ladies we have here. My name is Ivoire. What brings you here today? We came to see the CPU. Is she around? Can we just get Ivoire on the team? I would love to just hear him speak the entire time. How amazingly unfortunate. Meeting time with the CPU is done for today. No. Oh, come on. She's here, right? Just a little peek. Only a little. Neff, it's our fault being late. We'll come again tomorrow. Giving up so quick? I thought you were all over the goddess. What? Me? Yeah, but this isn't the right place to say such a thing. Innocence is so cruel. As one who serves the lady, I can't be happier with your admiration. But rules are rules. To add, the lady has matters to attend to. Such as video games. She seems to have developed this liking to this one game referred to as Fortnite. I, for one, don't understand what she likes about it. But she seems rather enthralled. Well, I guess we can't help it then. Well then, let's just tour the city to pass the time today. Sounds like a plan. Oh, um, Mr. Eviler. That's Ivoire to you, young lady. Do you know anything about a key fragment? Wait, did you really get my name? It would help a lot if you knew something, Mr. Evilist. Did my name become worse? <laughs> Just in case, it looks like this. Have you seen one before? I'm not getting myself involved in this mess. I see what you mean. Mr. Evil, whatchamacallit, do you know anything? Seventy years of my life, and I've never seen one like that before. <laughs> Shucks. But the lady may know. She was around for hundreds of years, after all. Hundreds? So that means Lady Greenheart is an old ca- oh. Okay, that's about it, Nep. Don't say a single word you were about to say. <gasps> Iffy, before Nep Nep says something bad, I think we better head out. You're right, Papa. It'll be a disaster if Nep muddles things up. I'm sorry. We'll come back tomorrow, then. Yes, I'll be waiting. Good day, sir. Oh, sorry. Are you okay? No problem. I'm sorry for not paying attention, too. What's the matter, Iffy? I just bumped into someone. You should be careful, Iffy. Yeah, at least I'm not as bad as Nep. Iffy, Papa, let's go. We're coming. Wait up! Iffy! That's... Oh, a guest? How may I help you? My name is Conversacion, an evangelist of the Wii. How unusual. And what brings an evangelist of Loe here? Please, do not be alarmed. I did not come to Leanbox to spread the word of Lady Whiteheart. Then the reason is aside from evangelizing? Yes, I come with information from Our Lady herself. Information, you say? Yes, it is in regards to the worship of the Overlord. Overlord worship? In game industry, there are four goddesses and people revere either one of them. But of recent, there are those who worship none of the goddesses. So they are turning to worship of the Overlord. But here, in Leanbox? I do not believe so, as those who live in Leanbox follow close to the CPU. But suppose such ones came from afar into Leanbox. And evangelize as you? No, they are heretics and do not evangelize such as myself. Instead, they find weaknesses and slowly turn people to the Overlord. So you are saying such are in Leanbox? Yes. 
For example, the young girls you have met earlier. They are heretics. Followers of the Overlord, Momus. What? That is hard to believe. Especially from youths such as them. As proof, they appeared in last station where the goddess's share fell. It's not working. And there we go. Monsters, inciting fear and destruction to the city. See for yourself. I can't believe what I saw, but it was real. The girl called Neptune summoned the monsters, destroying the city. It was a surreal sight, seeing the young child laugh amid the chaos. Just remembering it brings me the shivers. <sighs> All it is, is a testimony from a single person. How can you verify that it is the truth? Oh, Miss Conversation? How did that sound? Pretty real, right? Oh, oops. <laughs> you didn't see that. That was Mr. G, living in Last Station. Since his joining Avenir, he worked hard earning him rank among the company. His outstanding background is proof he is one to be trusted. Especially when he just talked about if that was a good enough move or good enough presentation. His background does speak words, but yet I cannot believe such innocence could do such a thing. Very well. Once I can get further proof, I will be back again. What do we want to do first? I heard there's a great cafe in a town nearby serving sublime scones. If Iffy says so, it must be good. Oh. Me three! <laughs> if Iffy says so, it must be good. Me three! Alright, forget what Kampa was gonna say. Get to the back burner, Kampa. Okay, then it's set. There should be a horse carriage that'll take us there. Huh? What do you mean the carriage isn't running? Well, we can't send them out with all those monsters out there now. So, can you tell us how we can get to the neighboring town? Hmm. The only way there is to go through the dungeon area. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know why I love that delivery from Kampa so much. Oh no! Please tell me there's like a thing that I can pull up that lets me play through the dialogue again. Uh, let me take a look here. Clicking some buttons. Oh jeez, no! Okay, well, that uh, didn't help actually. I actually missed dialogue that I don't remember. Well, that's too bad. I guess I'll just push more buttons and see if anything comes up. Or I'll screw it up. Okay, auto button is H. That's Hello good to know. Can I bother you for a moment? Not right now, Nep. I'm trying to find a button that works. E, there it is. Oh, sweet, I can replay. I love it so much. It's just like Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Hmm. The only way there is to go through the dungeon area. Oh no. Oh no. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, no. Hello there. Can I bother you for a moment? 
Sorry for the trouble. Oh, no. Hmm. The only way there is to go through the dungeon area. Oh, no. So, can you... Well, we can't send them out with all those monsters out there now. Oh, no. If Biffy says so in... Okay, then it's set. There should be a horse carriage that'll take us there. Huh? What do you mean the carriage isn't running? Well, we can't send them out with... Oh, no. All right. All right. We had our fun. We had our fun with that. I just love the the delivery of the line that is just, oh no, <laughs> it's fun. I enjoy it. Oh hey Tekken. Yes, we wanted to go to the town near here, but can you give us directions? Oh, just go south and then head straight. You can't miss it. Here, take this map. I don't need it anyway. Really? Yay! Thank you. Hmm. Huh. Huh. Is there it's like a turtle. Like yes. It's called your nose. Are you Neptune? Uh-huh. That's me. Why? Are you Neptune? Uh-huh. That's me. Why? Oh no. I knew it! Oh, I'm so happy to meet I knew it! Oh, I'm so happy to meet you! Oh, no! You know me? Yes! Well, to be precise, I know Neptune of a different world. Different world. So you're from another world, too? I think... I'm trying to remember this. I believe the reason we keep running into characters who are like... I remember you from another world, Neptune. I believe it's supposed to be from the original game. And we're playing Rebirth. But the original game has these characters as, like, side characters. But if I remember correctly, I think the characters in this game can become playable. Or that's only that's only in Hyper Dimension Neptunia 2. I don't really remember. I think I think he plays broccoli in Hyperdimension Neptunia too. So it might be that. Yes, my name is Tekken. Nice to meet you, Otherworld Neptune. Nice to meet you too. Hey Nep. Don't bother passerbys too much. Sorry. Looks like Iffy's calling me. Thanks for the map, Tekken. Sure. See you again, Neptune. It looks like both are friends in this world too. I hope I see them again. And we never come back to lean box. Informazione. Cat goes meow. New area unlocked. Miss Mountain, and we will explore MS Mountain in the next stream that I play this because I have a few things I need to do and then I need to sleep and my sleep schedule has already been very bad. I mean, did you not notice that I have been passing out on streams? I think I need to tone it down a little bit. So I will be ending for today, but I will be raiding somebody, probably, hopefully, unless nobody's live, in which case, you know, there's always that. So anyways, um, it's time to find people. Is there anybody who's live that we know? No. So then we'll have to find somebody instead. Such as... I don't think anyone would be playing Hyperdimension Neptunia Rebirth. Mainly because... Last time I checked, or every time I checked, nobody else was playing. And the same still stands. I don't really think people are playing all that much Hyperdimension Neptunia anymore. 
surely there's somebody playing a hyper dimension Neptunia game. We have Rebirth 3. Nobody's playing Rebirth 2. It looks like Rebirth 3 is the only thing getting any action. And that's a big person streaming it. So we're not going to do that. And we will instead raid somebody playing... Uh, what do we want to go for today? Do we go for VR chat? Do we look at VR chat people? Because we could do this. I feel like we do this or Minecraft. Actually, I might go Minecraft. I like Minecraft. And I also always raid VTubers, so I mean, it'd be fun to see VTuber Minecraft, excuse me. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I'm gonna mute my desktop audio so I can look at people. Without having to have the audio play through. Yay! Dum, 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 dum. Waiting for advertisements and lag. Hold on. I'm going to skip this person. But I'm also wanting to see other things, other things. Bum, bum. I'm also just enjoying the music right now. Doo -doo. All right. We will raid this person. Their name is going to be butchered by me reading. Uh. Epikachag. No. Epikachan Gaming, I believe. I P I K A C H A N G A M I N G. That is the person who we will be raiding today. Slash raid. The name I just said and will not be trying to pronounce again. Uh, so thank you guys for coming out. Appreciate it. I want to start picking up on the Neptunia games now. So that I can actually get around to them. Because I've been on Rebirth 1 for uh, about half a year. And I've done nothing, so, you know, it'd be fun to start progressing. I had fun with it, and I'm so ready to get into it again. So anyways, if you stick for the raid, be sure to show this person some appreciation. Uh, I'll be streaming who knows what, who knows when, some other time. That is all. Did I save? I don't know. I saved, so I'm going to quickly do this before the raid because I want to be there for the raid and I want to turn the audio off but I want to make sure I can hear all right great we did it awesome time to raid goodbye and then end stream